This is our 31st event, so it's been going on for a long time. Um, we have over 75 arts and crafts vendors, 25 food and beverage trucks, a beer garden, and six bands that will be performing throughout the day. I just like seeing the children come in with their families. It's a very family friendly event with the exception of the beer tent where it's 21 and older, but it's just great to see everyone come out, especially when the weather is beautiful and just have a good time. We have small amusement rides that are available and you can purchase a wristband for $10. It gives you unlimited access to the rides. Um, we have a clown that does face painting as well and um, several arts and crafts that are geared toward the, just the beer garden and our local bands that pull the people in. Um, you can start drinking at 10 a.m. when the beer garden opens and then we stop serving promptly at 5 p.m. so that's our biggest draw is um, our beer. Yeah the community really looks forward to it and then we have people travel in from everywhere uh, to be a part of it. My favorite part is seeing all the different arts and crafts vendors, um, everyone's talents that are brought forth and also just working with my team to make the day happen and successful it's um it's a really good time so it's free admission to the public with the exception of the rides you can get the wristband for ten dollars and have unlimited access to the rides and then friday night we're doing a preview of the rides and so that's from 3 to 8 p.m and then saturday the festival takes place 9 a.m until 6 p.m